Either. I got this. Hey folks, this is Iowether, and we're back with some more uh, Civ 5. Um, so again, this is a new recording stuff session, and I'm sorry, I might have to do a few of these where I do like one episode per recording session because uh, I don't have a ton of time right now. So I have time to play one game, or one 20 minute segment, <laughs> and then uh, yeah, get that out for you guys at a time. So, I don't remember what we were doing, but I'm sure I can figure it out really fast. Oh yeah, we said Tokyo because we want to steal that space. And Osaka because we want to steal oranges and bananas. And uh, we didn't quite steal all the oranges, really sad. But, uh, oh well, we did steal the sugar. And now the next uh, task is to make sure that Tokyo steals that sugar before they can get to it. And then uh, and we'll go from there. Uh, why were we making? Well, we have a barbarian camp up there that needs to get dealt with, which is probably what the warriors for. Cool. Okay. Just gonna proceed on to the next turn now that I have a semblance of knowing what the heck was. Uh, it's coming to my attention getting a friend with here. <laughs> Go away! I really don't care about you. I definitely don't care if you don't want me to be allied with. Um, uh, we're not trying to get out from here, right? Oh, cool. Well, now I know what's over there. Though, I'm fairly certain I knew that already. We're actually going to send the war uh, warrior here. Archer's coming out next. I miss having a queue. I've been playing a lot of Civ 6, and, um,. This is such a welcome relief. <laughs> having one of these. Oh, <clears throat> wow, where'd my voice go? Anyways, having one of these is so. Ugh, just love. The relief I feel. <laughs> Anyways. Oh, we're unhappy. No! Uh, why are we unhappy? This is copper. How long do we get it? Two turns? We're gonna be unhappy for two turns. That's unfortunate. But I can't do anything about it, so I'm not going to worry about it overall. Um, these guys here are pathing somewhere. Where are they pathing? Yes, okay, good. So we are going to send two warriors up towards that camp. Take that camp out, and then won't have to worry about those guys anymore. I'm sorry if you can hear a waterfall in the background. That's the landlord doing laundry. I can't stop that. Great. Anyways, um... Uh, we're right in the middle of a bunch of people, which I guess is going to happen. Oh, they did settle a city up here. Oh, man. I feel like I wanted to settle one up here. I guess I still could. They took the Behringer Crater, which I understand. I feel like I wanted to settle like up here somewhere, but um, I can't remember, and I don't have a settler coming out soon, so it doesn't really matter. Uh, I'm going to have to settle one either down here. I guess I could settle one here. It's not going to be the best city in the world to be settled down here, but it, it would have a few rainforests with it. Or otherwise, I could settle one up here. Again, not the best city in the world. Actually, a really bad city up here, but it's not the point. Otherwise, I guess I could take this over, burn it to the ground, and settle a city here, and then have a half-decent city. It's not a bad idea. I might have to do that at some point. Somebody found a Pantheon. Uh, did, we have already found our Pantheon, so we don't really care if somebody else found theirs. And we're just gonna run this guy back out before he gets trapped. Uh, we have our happiness up, good. And now we're just gonna get these guys over here where they can start uh, working on this. They can work on this, right? Yep. We do have the tech necessary. We have all sorts of. Um, I missed that. Being able to move across the river, up a hill. 
Oh, I missed that from <laughs> sub six where you can't do that. <laughs> Anyways, um, we do have all sorts of luxury resources laying around. Um, so these days are going to be fairly wealthy as far as the natural, uh, the luxury resources go anyway. Could steal that banana, but I don't see why I would. It's not worth money for. Um, I feel like I was gearing. Yeah, sure, I'll do that. Uh, I feel like I was gearing up for a war. Uh, two archers, two warriors. I can do a fair amount in this uh, setting with that kind of stuff. Of course, I'd, I'd prefer some. Oh, somebody's cleared this away. Probably these guys. That makes sense. Well, in that case, since there's no other, um, I'm just gonna head him to there. That means walk. That's what that means. I know it's strange me asking you to go somewhere, but just, just do it, okay? Um. Hmm. Anyways, I'm just gonna. Go the next turn. I think I'm gonna gear up an army um, and think about who I want to kill first. Uh, and most likely, he who commands the sea has command of everything. Cool. Most likely, it was going to be Spain um, because of the fact that then I get this entire half of the continent to myself, or I guess quarter or whatever. Um. And then I can go ahead and have my back to a wall kind of thing when I fight the rest. Okay, so let's start gearing up to take out uh, Spain then. Another archer and then a barracks and then a library. Yeah. That's right, um... Ooh, we have another trade route, so... Let's build a cargo ship so we can start pulling some cash in. Uh, and then... Uh, another archer and another warrior. Oh, sorry, archer. Yes, that's all good. What was I going for next after this? Nothing? Well... Mathematics will get us those catapults so we can start really thinking about taking out cities and where and courthouses are going to be important for that. And then I want this for the sailing benefits. Okay, so uh, I'd like to buy a workboat as soon as I can so I can get these fish going. Um, but I don't really have the, the turns to just get it in there. Uh, in our current queue, is, the, current, the queue is currently everything we really need. So, stuff we don't need is like a workboat. Um, and so I'll buy it when I get the chance to. We'll just bring these guys back up here. Um, we can have them explore here if we want to. And then I think I'm probably going to send them down to explore everything else. Um, I want to find this last, these last two players in the world uh, as soon as possible. Now, it would be really... Unfortunate if one of them was on an island and not on the main continent. Uh, which is possible. I've definitely had that happen before as... Uh, who was it? Was it... Was Russia? Where I was on this like continent about this size. All to myself. And she's like, uh, cool. Okay. So I just teched up. I went... Went for a science victory and got it because nobody could contest me. 
Uh, we'll just move here. Put him in the city. Uh, because that way he's defended and... Um, how long do you guys finish this? Three turns to clear the marshes. It's going to be another... Bleh. Okay. It's going to be a while. <laughs> That's what you're saying. Um, so I really need a worker out. What are you guys working on? Uh, this city, unfortunately, does not have any decent production. Uh, hmm. What are you working on? And then, after that, a worker. Ugh. Uh, water mill. What does a water mill need? Is it, is it built on our hill? Is that what we're going? Is that what's going on? No, it's not built on hill. Oh, we don't have the tech, do we? Duh. I'm a moron sometimes, especially when I'm not awake, and I'm gonna claim I'm not awake right now. So, oops. Uh, anyways, um, gonna keep gearing up for this war. So, the first city I'm gonna take out will be Seville. After that, I can use Seville as a staging ground to either go against Madrid or t try and take out Barcelona. Barcelona is gonna be insanely hard to take out. Because that's a hill, that's a hill, that's a hill, which means archers could stand here and here and hit the city. Is that a hill? Nope. Is that a hill? And archers might be able to stand. Well, that was interesting. Uh, archers might be able to stand here and hit the city. My screen just went black and then back. I don't know if you guys saw that or not. If you did, I don't know what happened. But apparently everything's fine. Whatever. Um, and if you didn't see it, then just ignore these ramblings and go back to what you were doing. Uh, so we're going to position guys on this side I need a better surveillance of Seville four people now in here okay um we're okay, lock that tile and walk. Is it this tile? Oops, no, no, that's not what I meant to do. <laughs> Good word. Alright. Five. Yeah, sure. Walk that tile. Five turns versus seven turns. Yeah, take the five turns and we grow a good bit slower. Which is fine because we don't have the happiness right now to grow anyway. So we'll do that. 11 turns, which the thing should be done in 11 turns. Nope, apparently not. Mm, we'll avoid growth, growth then. Um, no, I'd rather have you work in that if you're not going to work the 21 turns. Yeah, that's better in 4 turns till try and get sun. Good enough. And then after the shrine, what are you doing? Actual put a water water mill or water wheel. Good lord, water mill. Yeah, yeah, that's exactly what that thing is called. And you, uh, I need you work on this and that because we don't have the ability for you to grow right now. And that knocks it down to nine turns. And you are working like the best tiles you could work. Cool. Deal. Um, actually, work that. A little bit extra production, a little bit longer on the growth, and because I don't want to go into unhappiness. Zero happiness is far better than negative, or the negative one. Um, and I need 
at sort of movement. I wonder why there are so many workers out here. I guess they're going to improve everything over here. Wisdom and virtue are like the two wheels of a cart. Okay. So we get cherry archers, which are really effective if there's a lot of open terrain around you, which there's not. So not so effective for us. And water mills, uh, which are really helpful for just food and production. And, of course, roads. Welcome to the classical era. Yeah. Kill. We're in the classical area that uh, is more or less just an achievement. It doesn't actually help anything, but we still want it anyway. I'm going to put him there. And these scouts walk back here. Uh, that is actually really nice. We can put archers here, here, here. We can put archers all around this place and just ring it and decimate it and then move. Um, Melee units in to actually capture it, but they already have catapults. Oh, and they're building a road. Oh, I. Well, in that case. <laughs> in that case. <laughs> oh, I don't. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get somebody over here, um, in time. But I'm hoping I can get this guy there so that he, he can block that construction. Hopefully this... this <clears throat> wow, my voice. Hopefully this a worker is going to start on one of these and is not going to start a road here. Because that would be unfortunate and really smart of the AI. Um, but, you know, oh well. And you are just going to stop there. Actually, we're going to put you here. Um, and that is... Sorry that uh, you hear pokes from Steam as my fiancé um, telling me stuff. Oh, seriously? Please stop. Anyways, that's the end of that turn. Ah, good. Oh, they... Stop building the road. They got that tur bit of turf, though. Mm. So I'm gonna put him here. Uh, and we're just gonna do that. And that. And they have finally cleared this. Oh, and it's only six turns to build the plantation. Oh, good. Okay, good. That so much better. Well, in that case, I'm going to leave these two where they are. You need a water... <clears throat> wow, my voice. You need a watermill next? Um, you are unfortunately going to have to do just a granary. Um... <laughs> And you can default to whatever you want. Four versus four. Yeah. Oops. That's not what I meant to do. Anyways. <clears throat> cool. Um, next turn. I wonder if they're prepping an attack. That's definitely gone up in defense. Which actually probably means it has a guy in it, is actually what that means, I assume. Ooh, I can adopt a policy. Plus one gold and negative one unhappiness for every two citizens in the capital, which is really, really helpful. So our capital is currently at six. So that would reduce our unhappiness by three, which effectively gives us three happiness. And plus three gold, or we can get production towards wonders and plus one happiness for every ten citizens in the in a city. In a city, ooh, I didn't notice it said in a city before. For some reason, I've always thought that was plus ten citizens in your capital. Doesn't really matter. Our, our capital is currently our largest city, and it's a six, so this is moderately unhelpful. So we're just going to grab this for. The boost in happiness and the boost in gold. Mostly it's the boost in happiness. And we're just gonna un 
check both of these, put them back where they were. Seven turns, they'll grow. It's going to take a lot longer for that grant. Mm. No, I still think I want you working that. What is it? It's 14 turns or 7 turns. Yes. And it's 11 turns or 7 to growth. Yes. You're, you're working that. Lock it in. Um, 7 more turns will get a granular and that'll boost that by a lot. Probably cut in half. And, uh, and just overall it'll be better. Shrine's almost done. Barracks is almost done. Uh, we're going to buy a tile and buy that so that uh, that I mean now they only have the I guess they have two sugars in all right so they probably didn't need that sugar but I want it anyway because why not um I actually could have bought that bit of land and really like screwed them over but oh well um I'm going to move the scouts around here. Might as well set him up there. And they're going to complete that road because they figured out what I was up to and blocked me on it. Which I respect. <laughs> Why not? Um, and so yeah, that is all well and good. And we are progressing. Um, hopefully next episode... We will... No, I, I need the library before I start the war. And... It's five turns till we get... I'm going to have to put off that. And In five turns, the barracks will be out, and then we can get it, the library out, and then we can start getting the archers and the warriors out. And uh, with, like... I think we're going to try it with probably three archers, three warriors, and a couple catapults. And we're going to take Seville out first. And then take Madrid out. And then go for Barcelona. If I have to leave Barcelona by itself without um, getting killed, like, leave it alone entirely and take the rest of Spain out, I will. Because Barcelona is not a really amazing city. It's going to be pretty crap by the time I've stolen all the tiles I'm going to steal. And um, it just it's going to end up being not a great uh, city in particular. And so they're going to uh, end up... If, if this is all gets taken out, Spain is going to falter. And at some point, somebody's going to come over and kill them. And it's probably going to be me. But yeah. Uh, so that's it for this episode. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great night. This is I always.